What up YouTube? Welcome to East Sidekicks. My name is Chet and this is my channel. In here, I'll be talking about sneakers and the sneaker culture. I'll be reviewing sneakers from my own collection and the new ones that I will pick up in the future. I like to collect Nike products, particularly Air Jordans. If you're interested to join me in my journey across the sneaker world, subscribe and I will try to make it worth your while. Click the bell so that you won't miss any of my future videos. I will give away a pair of sneakers once I reach 2,000 subscribers and 6,000 watch hours. Help me reach this by sharing my videos to your crew. In this video, I will take you around my local Nike Park store in Makati City, Metro Manila, Philippines and show you what the current releases are there. I'm thinking of copying a pair of Jordan 5 Fire Reds. I'm not decided yet though. Stick around to the end of the video if I do. If you're following me on Instagram, you know the answer already. Follow me at EastSideKicks360 if you like to be updated. This is my very first video in this channel. I am not an expert, not yet at least, but I really love sneakers. So I hope you take it easy on me on the comment section. Starting off with the Jordan 5 Fire Reds with its white leather upper, black midsole, with fire red on the fire silhouette. Retails at 9,985 pesos or $200. Up next is the Air Jordan 4 Orange Metallic with an all-white upper and midsole with the hints of orange metallic on the wings, lace tabs, Jumpman logos at the tongue and also at the back. Retails at around 9,445 pesos or $190 US. This is the Air Jordan 13 Flint Gray. This is the fourth iteration of the Air Jordan 13 Flint with a grayish blue upper and flint gray midsole, UNC blue Jumpman logo at the tongue. Retails at around 9,445 or $190 US. This is the Air Jordan 34 white metallic silver. I think they call this the pure money colorway with an all-white upper and midsole with the hints of metallic silver on the tongue, Jumpman logos at the back, and the Jumpman logo on the outsole. This retails at 8,095 pesos or $160 US. Up next is another Air Jordan 34, this time in black. They call this colorway the Black Cat. Black Cat is one of MJ's famous nicknames. This retails at around 8,095 pesos or $160. Again, another AJ34 with the Infrared 23 colorway. With an all infrared upper and midsole, black at the tongue and at the back. This retails at around 8,095 pesos or $160. This one is the LeBron 17 Air Command Force. White upper with a multicolor right at the back side. Icy soles at the bottoms with hints of lime and yellow. This retails at around 9,985 pesos or $200 US. LeBron 17 Low Tune Squad with white upper and blue midsole and the red air unit. It comes with a pair of blue and red laces. And don't forget about the fur Nike swoosh that pays homage to Bugs Bunny. 
This is in anticipation of the Space Jam 2 movie in 2021. This retails at around 8,095 pesos or $160. We have another LeBron 17, this time the up tempo with an all red upper with outlines of white right at the tongue and a white and gray midsole. Retails at around 8,095 or $160 US. This is the Zoom Freak 1 with white and black colorway. I think this is part of the Oreo pack with white upper and black and white speckles at the swoosh. Retails at around 6,295 pesos or 110 US dollars. We have here a Kyrie 6 with a black upper with white midsole and the blue outline of the Nike swoosh logo. Retails at around 6745 or $120 US. The Jordan Max 200 with an all-white upper and white midsole including the bottoms with an icy sole on the heel. Retails at around 6295 or $110. We have here the Jordan 3 Unite SE. I don't know what the SE means. Is it special edition? Write in the comments. With a fire red upper with hints of black and cement gray. And don't forget about the iconic elephant prints. Retails at around $9,895 or $200. Now this is the Jordan Mars 270 with white leather upper and red and blue midsoles. The sole is made with 270 air unit. Retails at $8,045 or $170 US dollars. As you can see, these units here are on sale. You can see Kyrie 6s. You can see the Zoom Freak 1s. Even the Zoom Freak 1 black and white is on sale. Check out the sneakers with the sale tag. I believe these are up to 20% off. This is the Air Force One React. This must be the most comfortable Air Force One ever as it features a React technology sole with an all-white upper and midsole with an oversized Nike swoosh outline at the side. Retails at around 6,295 pesos or 110 US dollars. This is the Nike Presto React. Upper is in white with multicolor print midsole is in white as well with hints of peach details at 6745 or 120 US dollars the Air Max 90 with a white leather upper and blue leather upper right above the midsole midsole is in white the Air Max 90 air unit is in yellow. Retails at 6,895 or 120 US dollars. Now this is Nike's modern take on the Air Max 90. This is the Air Max 2090. It has a white mesh upper with a hint of yellow right above the laces. Yellow midsoles with the Air Max 2090 air unit heel is in turquoise. Retails is about 8,095 or 160 US dollars. Now, finally, we have the Nike React Infinity Run with an orange fly knit upper with an orange React midsole. It is the lightest sneaker I have ever lifted here. Retails at 8095 or 160 US dollars.
You've guessed right. I did cop the Jordan 5 Fire Red. Watch out for my next video as I review this pair next. If you're still here up to this point, you are awesome. In Filipino, astig ka. Comment below, astig, so I know who you are.